The way the land trust works, to be really clear, is that the trust will own the land in perpetuity, and then they sell the house to a buyer who can afford it. It becomes more affordable to the person to be able to purchase just the house without the land, because the land typically represents at least about a third of the cost of an overall piece of property. That's affordable, so the goal is, is to try and keep the workforce here living here. But it's really to get the first time uh, home buyers in here and to provide a place for the next generation of folks who might not be able to afford to live here. We were thrilled when Chesterfield County awarded the Land Trust a $500,000 community development block grant to do this work. And we've wanted to be in Chesterfield since our inception, so we're really excited about this partnership. One of our goals is to create housing that's affordable in perpetuity. And we do that, but with a kind of a split equity formula. In other words, our homeowners own their house, but we, the trust, own the land under the house. And so in five to seven years, when that homeowner goes to sell, we split the equity in the home 50-50. You have a, an owner of land whose mission it is is to take care of the property. You get long-term stability, you know, and in some of the areas that we would like to try and move into, I think that's a real important point to have. Particularly in Chesterfield, we're interested in going into neighborhoods that perhaps need a little TLC and injecting home ownership in opportunities into those neighborhoods. This program enables anyone who earns between 50% and 115% of area median income to purchase the homes that we will be uh, renovating. This is assessed as land and, and building, except that the land will be paid for by the community land trust and the taxes on the house will be paid by the homeowner. And so it'll just, the, the bill is divided that way. So we are going to make sure that our homeowners maintain their properties because it's their house, but it's our land. So we have a vested interest in the success of our homeowners and the success of that neighborhood.